Hello. Yes, this is she. Yeah, I'm trying to file a divorce because. No, he's not cheating on me. No, he's not abusive. No, none of that. Oh, man. It's, don't laugh at me, but... If, my husband, he can... He can snore. He can snore like an, like an incoming ship. He can... Not only that, his mouth can be open like dead body. Oh, I mean, uh, it can be so gross. It can be, so, I can be so gross. Her mouth can be wide open and then spit can be coming out. Sometimes I feel like her guts just point out of his mouth when he go to sleep. I love the man. Oh, Lord, forgive me. I love the man, but when he's snoring, sometimes. It can, it can be very, it can be very frightening and, and very scary too. Sometimes I feel like he will swallow his own tongue. It's, it's just, I can't bear. I can't even sleep in my own room, you know. So now we start when we finish really having fun. I run away and can't sleep in my girl's room. I sleep on the couch. I, I understand, ma'am. I understand. But that's not the only thing. You, he's snoring that much, and then he's farting too. Can you imagine? Exactly. That's why everybody say when I tell them, oh, my God. And I'm glad you're saying, oh, my God. In nasty. Nastiness. Okay? <laughs> Sometimes I'm like, I Maybe the women who deal with cheating men may be a little bit better, but then uh, that's even worse because he can bring you diseases. But a man snoring his mouth open, tell you what his spit, his spit got arm and legs, they're crawling. I mean, the pillow can be soaking wet. He can be farting. And that ain't any kind of good smelling fart. I mean, it smells like sewage. It's loud. He can be talking in his sleep. And the worst part of all this, the funky fart. Just, I mean, when he fart, as if he, he he literally took a number two, like he poo poo. It can smell like real poo poo. I don't know if he's suffering from constipation and all this gas is escaping from 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 the corners and patches around the constipated, nasty black decay rot and poo, and it's. It, it just smells horrible. It just smells horrible. I mean, I, I, I think this. I think this is the worst thing. I, I, I don't. Yeah, he gains some weight, but it's not that much for him to be doing all that at night. And, and he can be talking in his sleep. I don't know what to do. The worst part is his mouth. You know, people who sleep with him. Him. Sometimes he can turn around. He want to kiss me at night and. Oh, his mouth can be so stink. I'll calm down. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. This is so traumatizing. Every time. Every time I talk about it, I get so emotional. When I see his mouth coming towards me at night. When I see his mouth, when I see those lips coming at me at night, all I think of is, I, I, I sometimes just want to die because those mouths look like a toilet seat coming at me that got boo-boo on it because it smells so bad and his lips are so big, it already stinks. Dang. I don't know if he be dreaming about me. Lord have mercy. I hope he stops dreaming. Because he just comes like. He comes at me in those things. And Lord knows. Oh. So ma'am. Enough of me talking about it. I mean. I mean. That's that's that's, that's just the reason why I need. I want to defoge him. I don't know. 
You think you guys can help me? I mean, I'm just so comfortable. I don't know. I, I can't do this anymore. I, I, I don't know. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Thursday. Uh, we, how are we going to go to counseling about stuff like that? Those like a bodily malfunction. His, his body is just malfunctioning in so many different ways that the snoring we've been trying. What, 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 what are you going to do with somebody who farts at night? I need, I, you can at least manage the snoring because there are some, some, some other remedies for that. But you, you can close somebody, but somebody that just farting, but just exploding bunch of toxic gas at night. How do you control that? Ah, uh, we've, we've tried those over counter med medications, but and if, if his mouth is open and all the, he's salivating and then he, he's coming at me with those toilet seat lips that just smells so horrible at night. It's, it's just more, we've talked about this we, we've talked about this um, I don't know it seems like everybody I call it just I, yeah I can bring him in I can bring him in I, I, I haven't talked to him it's, I haven't talked to him about divorcing him because of these reasons and it, it's kind of embarrassing it's you know, I think it's really going to hurt his feelings. Okay. You know what? Let me just think about it. I will talk to him about it and then see how he responds. Now I'll call you back. Okay. Bye, man.